hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna be making this sheer top with sleeves well let's get to it that's my girl For this project, I'm making use of this Ankara fabric that I've used for some other projects. It's about one yard here. I want the length of my top to be 12, but I'm just going to add one inch to it, making it 13 inches. Now for the width of my top is going to be 25 plus 1 inch making it 26. Now depending on your size you can make it as wide as it can be. As wide as it needs to be. So now I'm just going to call out my measurements out now you fold your fabric into two but now it's four layers now you're going to cut four by two for your arm hole Now we're done with that. Now what is left to do is to cut out our sleeves. Now for the sleeves. The width of my sleeve is 17. That's plus sewing allowance. And the length of my sleeve is gonna be 6. So sewing allowance 7. Let's cut that out. When you're done cutting out the sleeves, place your sleeves under your bodice to trim out the armhole so it could it can be equal. After you're done doing that, then we're gonna go and share. Before going to share your top, hem the top and the bottom of all your pieces fold it in twice and then you hem it then you can share your pieces when you're done sharing your top you're gonna have to iron it iron it down it's gonna make Help the elastic thread to be more elastic. If that makes any sense. Anyways, what I'm saying is that you should iron it. Now you're not ironing, this is what it should look like. All you have to do now is place the right side sides on each other. Like this. And then you pin them down and sew them by the side. And leaving the four the four inches that we left down for the armhole. Don't not sew your armhole. That is why you're going to pin them right beneath your armhole and then you sew them down. When you're done that, 
you're just gonna have to attach your sleeves do the same thing with your sleeves then you attach them to your top where the armhole um, space is so let's do that so now I attach one of my sleeves to the top and I just wasn't feeling it when I tried it on I just didn't like how it looked how it looked so I don't know I just felt like the top needed more so I'm just going to take out the sleeves and do a new sleeve all over again yeah okay let's do that So I went out and I got this organza to come and try and make some new sleeves. Now I'm just going to so I'm not gonna trash my old sleeves no. I'm just going to use them and add them to the organza. Now I'm just going to put them right here like Now the length of my old sleeve was 6 and right now I want long sleeves so the 6 plus 20 is gonna make my sleeves long so i'm going to cut the organza to be 20 20 length for the length and 28 for the width well let's cut that When you're done cutting out your sleeves, you're gonna leave um, four inches space 
for attaching your sleeves to your bodies. After that, you're gonna sew from that four inches upwards to create a case so that you're gonna pass your elastic through. Now you're gonna leave enough space for your elastic to go through, depending on which one you're using. You're gonna take it in twice so the rough side doesn't fray when you sew it. When you're done creating the case for your elastic, you're also gonna gather down your the bottom of your sleeve. When you're done doing that, then you can pull your elastic through the case you created. After that, you sew your sleeve by the side, then you can attach it to the bodice. Now to attach your sleeve, pin the armhole of your bodice to the armhole of your sleeve, right size kissing. Pin them together and then you sew. Now for your cuff, you can either take your cuff in, turn your top inside out and place your cuff on the inside and sew or you can put it on the outside, right side facing and then you pin it down, take it to your machine and then you sew it round. When you're done doing all that, this is how your top should look like. Nice, right? Now, let's style it. So I styled my top with two different pants. And it's so amazing, guys. There's the back view and wow. I also tried it on with some skinny jeans and it is amazing. I also tried on this top with the skirt and wow. Anyways, I also have a video on how to make this skirt so make sure to watch it. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and God bless. Bye.